Hi, I'm Connie Ladenberg and welcome to The Business Next Door. Today we're at Sheeney Stadium and this is the home of the Rainiers. And you may be wondering, how is Sheeney Stadium a business? Today you're gonna find out. Thank you, Aaron, for having us here today. How about telling us a little bit about who you are? Well, I'm Aaron Artman. I'm the president of the Tacoma Rainiers sure. since 2007. Aaron, there is a lot of history in this stadium, so maybe you can tell us a little bit more about the history. The cool thing about Cheney Stadium is it's the longest serving in the Pacific Coast League single location for a AAA wow. baseball team, yeah. dating back to 1960. And even before that, the Tacoma Tigers at the turn of the century were the first professional baseball team in the state. Fast forward to more recent years. So tell me about how we now have this in front of us. Well, one of the best parts about the renovation, in my opinion, is we kept the original seating bowl. And all the trends in new baseball parks are to have this very gradual seating bowl that spans all the way down the lines, right. which makes it really quiet and not as communal. But if you really think about it, you know, someone could have come to opening day in 1960, like John probably did, and, yes. and I know our majority owner, Michael, did, and basically sit in the exact same seat with the exact same pitch and everything else that you have right now in 2018, which really kind of ties the generation of baseball fans together. Obviously, the amenities got better, architecturally better, uh, more restrooms, more food choices, all that. But, right. it, but in the heart of hearts for a baseball fan, you're sitting in the same place, you know, for the last almost 60 years, yeah. which is really rare when you do a renovation. Our brand has completely taken off, and it's one of the greatest logo stories you'll ever hear in your life because we didn't name the team the Rainiers. George Foster did that in right. 1995, and one day we're sitting there and we say we have this beautiful R that's in our script. Let's put it on a hat and see if people yeah. buy it. Put it on a hat, people bought it, did it the next year, people bought it. We go, okay, we don't need to hire an ad agency, we don't need to do any focus group testing. The people have spoken, we will just use the R. So the logo was there, how we use it with We Are Tacoma, We Are Family, Our City, has been a really fun journey. And, and one of our goals here, you know, obviously we're a business, we have to make money and, and stay successful, but we really try to be a beacon of what's possible for Tacoma. And so all the kind of motivation behind the slogans we've generated from it with the logo, the hats you see everywhere, is to make people proud of Tacoma and help them be aspirational about Tacoma. And as Tacoma's on this surge right now, we like to think we're, we were a small part of it. We take great pride in that. Um, so it isn't always about the business or what we're doing. This, this truly should be a place that Tacoma feels a sense of pride and forward thinking, and we don't need to be Seattle. We're not anyone's little brother or sister. Right. We are Tacoma. <laughs> Uh, where we're sitting right now, the R Yard, is a, is a great uh, partnership model between the city and the ownership group decided we needed to add another area right. post mm -hmm. the renovation in 2011 so we'd have a little action out here in the outfield. The uh, children's play area, the Mary Bridge Family Pavilion, yes. with the wiffle ball field and the play area was a partnership between the Cheney Foundation, the team, and Metro Parks. So we have these great community partnerships, and then we have a lot of business partnerships. You know, a, a huge ecosystem here in Tacoma of mm -hmm. partners we use from everything from linens with Superior Linen to coffee partnerships to local beer distributor and local craft beers and food choices. So it, it really is, you're only as strong as your partners is, is really true and, and significantly true here at Chief. Why don't you tell us a little bit about who you are and what it is that you do? Absolutely. My name is Casey Catherwood. I'm the creative director here at Tacoma Rainiers. You are now in the control room here for Cheney hey. Stadium, which is where all the technical magic happens. This is control central. Oh, yes. Yeah. So what else do you have here? Well, we've got our music computer. We've got our, our mixing boards. We've got our PA announcers, mics, stat, stat machines, uh, free play machines, video board machines. And over here, we have our video switcher. Um, in fact, this is what controls all of the signal out to our video board. So why don't you uh, move this lever up here, go ahead. It's not gonna bite. It's not going to bite you. And then you just pushed that out to oh, our video board that. out there. Hey. It says, welcome council member, Connie Ladenberg. <laughs> hey, that's very fun. Well, obviously there's a lot that goes on behind the scenes and to make your day and our experience fabulous, so. Terrific team. We have up to 15, 16 people here right. on any given okay. night working. Okay. Um, a lot of them are interns in a partnership that we have with Bates Technical College. Oh, so they nice. come in here green 
and our amazing leadership technical director yeah. makes sure that yeah. they are fully ready to go into the workforce by the end of the season. Another great example of partners. Absolutely. And yeah. it makes this place run, which is yeah. really cool. Yeah. So Aaron, today we've heard a lot about the past and what's happening right now. How about sharing something about the future? We always try to make this place better. And so at the end of each season, we literally talk as a board and we talk with the city and we talk with Metro Parks and Cheney Foundation, what else can we add? I'm sure there's more in store for this stadium specifically. What we're really focused on now though is how do we take this ballpark stadium uh, at a soccer stadium and create a real new experience in Central Tacoma with you know restaurants, shopping, apartments, and, and really make this area, because it's so geographically perfectly located in the city, right. an economic driver. This is Tacoma's ballpark and Tacoma's treasure, and we think pound for pound, we can provide an experience in this stadium that's as good or better than anything else at any level. Yeah. Um, and it's, it's really about having a soul that's uniquely Tacoma and having food and beer and experience that makes you feel at home. And so that's what we try to do here and, and uh, we hope we're successful and we hope the people love it. I think they do. I know I do. I'm going to keep I coming. I do too. Thank <laughs> you. <coming> here. Thanks. <laughs>